Kakamega County received the new PBO pyrethroid nets in response to the emerging resistance by mosquitoes to pyrethroid only nets. Additionally, these nets are now being provided to pregnant women and children. You will agree with me that these new technology nets have led to a significant reduction in malaria cases in Kakamega. In the area of prevention, let me say something about the Kenya-Cuba Malaria Vector Control Project. This is another new layer of intervention that we want to deploy in our fight against malaria. And this is larval control. These larvae which are found in breeding places in water, standing water, are the targets of this intervention. And they will be engaged in a program of periodically spraying stagnant water which are breeding places for mosquitoes with biological larvicides, harmless biological larvicides that selectively kill the larvae of mosquito, which means that the mosquitoes do not mature and do not become adults. Our central stores at Kemsa and Meds continue to stock adequate commodities against the fight for malaria, the fight against malaria. I urge all the counties to order these commodities in a timely manner and ensure that all health facilities and community health workers have enough commodities, especially during this raining season when malaria cases are expected to rise.